Hey everyone, how's it going? My name is Kyle, this is Kyle Plays Games, and this is Euro Truck Simulator 2. Uh, we continue on with that career here. Um, now, uh, something happened on my Twitch stream that, uh, for some reason, I got disconnected. I could see it on my, um, video, um, software here that it somehow skipped. So, um, just to let you know, I did spend the, uh, skill point on the eco-driving, so now we do have 25% of fuel, uh, saved now when we're driving with a trailer or, or free. Uh, that's just the... Um, little thing that occurred, so we're gonna continue on with this one. It's all like uncut here. Um, gonna continue on with that career. Like I said, we we stopped off at Luxembourg for the last uh, stop, and that was a drive from hell. So if you uh, haven't seen that one, uh, feel free to take a look uh, in the playlist of uh, Euro Truck Simulator 2. That was a tough one. I yeah, I've learned a few things when it come to that one. Speaking about for learning things, I do want to make a shout out to uh, one of my subscribers who has been helping me out with learning uh, Euro Truck when it comes to learning a lot of stuff um, about Europe and how to like say the names or uh, one of its uh, miles per hour, kilometers per hour. Uh, um, several other things, and uh, I do want to thank him personally on here, uh, Tram Steve from uh, Tram Steve Gaming. Uh, he's got his own YouTube channel also. Um, so uh, shout out to him uh, right now on the channel, and uh, I did not forget about your um, name this time. Uh, definitely wrote it down, so I didn't forget about it. All right, so um, I'm gonna click on drive, get this um, video underway here. As it loads up, I ask you please like, share, and subscribe, and let me know what you think about the video in the comments down below. And if you'd like to watch any of these videos happen live, link is in the description down below for the Twitch channel, and be sure to follow along on Twitch so you do not miss out when I go live. And if you'd like to help contribute to the channel in other ways to help it grow in um, other ways, uh, there are a few other links in the description down below. And if you do contribute in those ways, I will in turn add your username to future um, videos at the end screen of future videos. All right, so let's go ahead and get this one going here. Let's go ahead and turn off the wipers. We don't need the wipers going. Still have over th um, two thirds of my fuel. So I just need to find a rest stop. And I think I know where one is at, but I'm just gonna double check on the map. Let's, uh, let's do a resting spot where we have here. Oh, yeah, right in front of us here. Perfect. Okay, I'm not even going to need to set that on the map. All right, let's get going, and uh, let's find a place to rest. Because we are definitely exhausted. That was a long trip. I don't know. Do they stop here? No, they don't stop. They were going to stop right in front of me. Because why not? Why not make this a little bit more of a longer video, you know? Okay, I'm gonna go. I still, I, I gotta get used to this again with uh, when it comes to driving uh, on my right side of the uh, of the car. Um, I'm gonna check to see: is there any red light violation for going? There was not. Either that or there is, and there wasn't a cop around, so I didn't get hit with it. I get down to the rest stop. I am so exhausted. I'm kind of speeding just in order to get to this spot. Is it in the, uh, I think, oh, I think it's in the truck stop. Like, the in, in the uh, dealership. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Okay, I discovered a Volvo truck dealer. Can't afford a new truck. I'm happy with this one right now, but at least I know where the Volvo ones are at. Alright, let's rest. And... Oh, it's raining now. It's midnight. I got woken up by the rain. Uh, I'm gonna start up the car... Start, up, start it up, and I'm gonna get... Turn on the wipers. I'm gonna get a mechanic. Where is that mechanic at? Just need to scoot on over. Get in there. Okay. We need some repairs. I know I messed up everything. Yes, I did. Told to pay. I just no insurance. Oh boy. Okay. Lesson learned. Lesson learned. Let's repair this. Ah, boy. 
All right, let's go ahead and get ourselves a job because I got some money to get. And let's go into the map uh, and let's find ourselves in the freight market. Hopefully we get something in Luxembourg. Okay, Luxembourg, we have only like a $5,000 one. Metal coil, it is a quick one though. Luxembourg to Cologne. Is that, well, is a D there. There's no way that's Denmark. There's no way. I'm so lost, because that's, that's Denmark. Why does it say D on there? Please let me know in the comments why it says that. I mean, I'm going to have it labeled like that, but I'm very curious as to why it says D instead of um, G for Germany. Hmm. But we're going to take this one and get and get some get our money back. Basically, going to break even from the repairs that I had to incur. Okay, so where is this job? Boy, I can barely see. Well, it is midnight. Oh, oh, oh! It's 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 one lane, one lane. Oh, okay. I can't I can't uh, go back, so I am just going to go forward. Oh, I love the lightning effect. Oh, I love that. That was a nice little upgrade. Okay, yes, I understand I discovered an equipment center. I can't even afford my own truck right now. I got a roundabout, no cars coming. It's it's dead midnight right now. There's no way there's a bunch of traffic. Get into the left lane because I need to uh, turn left eventually. I like the effect of the street lights being out. Like they're not, I, I mean the traffic lights being out as in like the traffic is uh, basically saying, you know, like, okay, we already know there's not a whole lot of traffic, just proceed with caution. That is pretty cool. Okay, so where, okay, so I had turned in here. Don't crash into the heads. Boy, it's so, so difficult for me to end up driving on this side. I, I mean, my next car might be a left, might be on the left side. My, my steering wheel might be on my left side. Because that is, it's just so difficult for me to do that. Okay, so, uh, yep, we are traveling from Luxembourg to Cologne. And if I'm saying that right, I want to say it both ways. Cologne, Cologne, just for the hell of it, Cologne. Doubt that's correct. I think it's Cologne, like the fragrance, like the men's fragrance. I'm going to go with that. If I'm saying it wrong, let me know in the comments, please. All right, so where are my coils? They are right in front of me. They're not gonna rust with uh, the uh, rain, right? They're not gonna, we'll be fine. I hope we, I hope it will be. Right, let's pull ahead. I need to turn these wipers on a little bit more. That's super loud, that is really loud in my ear. Wow. That's some heavy rain coming down. Alright, we got we got our uh, shipment available. We have ourselves hitched up and time to make ourselves to Cologne. Hopefully I don't smell getting there. Yep, that was a really bad joke. I apologize. Feel free to make fun of me in the comments. While you're at it, be sure to subscribe to the channel. Help support the channel. I can't even tell like how my camera's supposed to be. I'm gonna stop just for the hell of it. There's literally no traffic, so that's great. I do have to deal with a real traffic signal now. Stop. I must take it up both lanes because I can. 
Only because I have really, I'm really bad at driving. Don't you hit me. You do not hit me. I'm not going to run this red light. In the far right lane, because I have to turn right um, practically immediately. I can't see the light, but I'll wait till the hue changes. May go up a little bit, may go up a little bit, go up a little bit. And there we go. Okay, alright. Good enough. I probably could have went anyway, but I didn't want to take a chance with the trailer. Make that wide swing just to make sure I clear it, clear the turn. There's more barricades uh, in this game in Europe than what there is in the American Truck Simulator. Because I could have uh, driven over the curb in uh, an American Truck Simulator. I can't do it here. Adds a little bit more to the difficulty to it. I'm going to get over to the right lane. Still dr driving on this side of the. Uh, cab is uh, difficult for me anyway. Oh, we got that winding road coming in. Ah, great. This one gave me trouble when I was uh, coming into Luxembourg. Let's go slow. Let's go slow. Not slow enough. I just don't trust myself on these uh, on these roads. I am really uh, tentative, and I gotta get it. I gotta get over. Oh, come on! Okay, either pass me or get or move out of the way. Like I knew that was going to merge. Like I knew it. I think I need my brights on here just to be able to see a little bit more. I'm being super tentative this time. I am really cautious. Got a 90 degree curve coming up. Be real careful here. Real careful. I have so much P PTSD for my last delivery. Is this now a one lane road or is this two? What the hell just happened here? I can't tell. I'm gonna stay over on the right side. I feel like it's turned into a wide single lane road. Now we're back to a double lane road. What in the hell? That part of the road didn't make any sense to me. I gotta get over that. I gotta pay more attention to what's ahead of me. Okay, going far too fast for uh, this road. Thirty-seven miles per hour. The um, conversion from kilometers to miles per hour, I get. It makes sense if I understood it, but because, like, I'm so used to seeing 45 miles per hour, 65 miles per hour, something like that, like, seeing 37 makes me think, like, okay, so that a speed, like, 35. But I get it, you know, like, this is all in kilometers per hour, and I'm, on, and I'm using the metric of miles per hour because it's a lot easier for me to read it on my dash. 
I still have the HUD on because I don't have a GPS in the truck. If there's a way for me to get a GPS in this truck, let me know in the comments, please, because I, uh, I want to get this HUD off of my screen and make it be more like an authentic experience. I don't even want to have the mirror um, on the left side of the screen where my, uh, oh my gosh, I didn't re even realize I am blurry. I am blurry. I apologize. Oh, come on. Unblur. Unblur. I'm literally trying to drive and unblur my camera at the same time. Come on, focus in, focus in. Okay, it might be a little, might be a little better, but I know it's not crystal clear. I did not realize that was that that was that blurred. Wow, 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 wow. Should really take a look at my. Uh, recording system a little more often, but I don't want to do that when I'm driving because I don't want to miss out on, you know, avoiding cars. Okay, that's going to be about as clear as it's going to be t uh, tonight. Live streaming. You never know what's going to happen, you know? Sorry for anyone who tuned in for this being their first video of wa uh, watching me either live stream or uh, just wa is coming into uh, my YouTube channel and seeing a blurred camera. Boy, that's embarrassing. But we gotta run with it. It is what it is right now. I'll get it fixed for the next video. Be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out and you can see the fact that I'll have it corrected. I really should have checked that before I even started. I could have sworn it looked a lot better before I started. I'm definitely speeding. Just coast there, just coast to the intersection. We gotta turn anyway, so we gotta slow it down. Slow it down. Wheels are bad. Wheels are bad. Oh boy! What in the? How come I? How am I not slowing down? Is it because like the rain is like that bad? Is the rain that bad on my tires that I cannot slow down quick enough? I didn't even deal with any kind of uh, police barricade this time. I just couldn't stop. Get my brakes checked somehow. Okay, it is 56, so I do need to get I do need to get going. Get speeding a little bit more. I don't know what half of those road signs mean. I get what that one meant, parking and gas. But that last one that said 50 and 100 with a, like a city skyline and a no city skyline. What? What am I How am I supposed to translate that? These are the questions I need answers for, people. Fifty-eight miles to go, an hour and a half left of this journey to Cologne. I'm not even at fifty-six miles per hour. I'm gonna get passed up here on the right side. Should have paid attention to my GPS. Good thing I did not have to exit there. It's 50 now. Why did it drop? Why did it drop? All right, so I do need to merge. Let's go ahead and get over. I swear to you, if I get one of those exits, or like that this turns into an exit, and I can't take it. Why would you make me merge? But I'm just following along with this. Uh, TPS because I need to pay more attention to it. Is this a bridge we're going over? We're going over a bridge. That is pretty cool. That is really cool. Okay, it looks like the rain has stopped. So I can turn that off. 
still using my brights because like I mean like aside from this bridge like it's uh, pretty pretty pitch black out here and I wouldn't be able to see as much as possible that's why you start using in uh, American Truck 2 when it's like pitch black out so I so you guys can see a lot more of the of the uh, road I need to start using the brights more we are an hour away from our destination about 30 miles left still kind of rainy but it's more of a sprinkle so I don't really need to use the uh, wipers it's gonna run off my gas gauge like man I don't even have to fill up like ever I think maybe once I reach about halfway I need to start worrying about it I need to move my truck a little bit more over to the right I'm so used to going on the left side of the lanes. Again, that's the driving on the uh, left side of the cabin for you instead of right. Okay, which one is my exit? What is my exit? Is this a double lane? It's not a double lane. Okay, I'm getting over. Slow it down. Slow it down. I'm so nervous now when it comes to entering and exiting highways. Like, this is, like, really a tight turn. And this is even tighter. Okay, slow it down, slow it down, slow it down. Can I get the braking system working? Yes, I can. Okay, now we are slowing down. And we're stopped. Okay, we got car. We got traffic coming. Can't tell. Nothing over there. I can't tell over here. I, no, there's nothing. Okay, I'm going to make that turn. All right, we are 13 miles away, about a half an hour. And I'm going to keep my brights on until I get to the uh, spot I need to be at. Once we start getting city lights, well, I don't even know if I'll get city lights here, but once we get more lit up, then I'll turn the brights off. Oh, nice little cityscape we're heading to. Don't get distracted by the cityscape, Kyle. You still have turns to make. You still have these curves. And I am very, very dangerous on curves. Very dangerous. Hence the previous video of everything. Slow it down, slow it down. Okay, this is cross traffic does not stop. Just be very cautious. No car coming this way. There is a truck coming. There is another car coming. I don't see headlights after this one. Anything over here? Yep, two of them. I think I can pull out, though. Pull out and, and go. Go, go, go. Am I going on the Autobahn? Am I on the Autobahn now? There's no way. I'm, it's only 50. It just seems like I'm on the Autobahn because it looks like something like that. But okay, Cologne is up ahead. I can't gain up the speed. I really can't. All right, we're in the city. Let's go turn off these brights. We have discovered Cologne. I need to slow it down because I don't want a speeding ticket here. It looks like I just have to coast up and... Uh, is this a turn right or turn left? I don't know. It looks like it's a roundabout, you know? I really can't tell, but I just, I'm just going to creep our way up. That's a good stopping point for me. You got the red light right in front of my eyes. No way I'm missing this. Just keep an eye on that camera, man. Cannot believe I was blurred out for most of that video. Discovered another recruitment center. That's good to know. I'm not going to use that anytime soon. Slow it down, slow it down. 
get it around around the line and good. That was pretty smooth. That was a pretty smooth stop. I said teach myself to do that more often. Yeah, literally just sitting here just waiting for this light to change. Nothing going on. This is done purposely so it could be able to load up. Okay, I guess so it could load up more of the game probably. So it looks like I turn right and then I just follow the road, I guess. That's what it, that's what it seems like. There is a garage I could purchase here. I need to per I need to pay off the truck first before I purchase anything new. Can't wait to see this light, but well, you can still see the bit of the hue. All right, here we go. And we'll turn right. And we have to turn left because there's no road up ahead. That makes things a lot easier for me. Do not turn red. Okay, we're good. Make that wide swing. And look at that. We have made it with only one off-road incident. I didn't really say that yet because, I mean, like, something could happen near the end here. Okay, I doubt I needed a, the turn signal, but, you know, force to have it, might as well. I doubt there was going to be any traffic. Alright, we have made it. Do we play it safe? Why would I do that? I'd always say that just in order to be able to add the drama to it. Where do you need it? That is going to be a little bit, that's going to be a little tricky one, but it's, you know, just like, oops, drive around, up here, and then back in. Um, I'd say about five attempts. Alright, let's go get out of the truck. Let's take a look at everything from the uh, secondary part of the screen. Or, you know, the third person point of view. I don't mind this camera when it comes to, like, driving it, but I don't have any depth perception when it comes to, like, just driving around. I would ram into so many NPCs. Uh, NBC car is just driving this alone like you know just like this. I mean I would so get it wrong Okay, okay, we can just slap it here. Let's turn the camera around and I think if I cut the wheels I might be able to back this in I Did not get that correct. Well, it might it might work. It might work Let's just go real slow. Let's go real slow I cut the wheels too sharp. I cut the wheels way too sharp. Can you please just stop moving that fast? How are you dri How are you moving that fast? All right, cut the wheels more. Cut the wheels more. No, you know what? No, not even. Not even gonna try it. Not even gonna try it. That was a uh, a moment there. Where I thought that something was in front of me. All right. And we want to cut them. Wait, how do we want to cut them? Is it this way? Is it this way? No. Wait. Yeah. 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 That would straighten it out. Okay. Go slow. Go slow with it. Cut the wheels a little bit more. Cut the wheels more. Get the trailer looking a little bit better. Cut back. Cut back. And then we want to straighten out those wheels again. Turn the wheels. Come on. How are you that slow at turning, at cutting the wheels? How are you that slow? Ah, then again, you know, like I went off road momentarily. Why? 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 Okay, I'm getting myself all confused, all confused right now. I did say it was going to take about five tries, but maybe I might get lucky on this third one. Nope, not that way. Not that way. Cut the wheels the other way. Cut them. Cut them.
Hit the brakes, hit the brakes. Nope, nope, nope. I don't get why you did that. Come on, just turn the wheels. You are so slow at cutting the wheel. So slow. I am so OCD when it comes to this. I, th I need to just accept this. That I already have it in the green. But I just can't do it. I can't do it. I have to make it just perfectly. And this is my detriment. This is my downfall. This is my downfall right here. And I ran into the cement block. I need, I, need, I need to give it up. I need to give it up. This is perfect. Let's go ahead and just like place it here. Let's decoup and call it a night. There we go. Okay. Metal coil delivered from Luxembourg to Cologne. A base reward of 4,673 euros. Proficiency bonus 244 euros. And that, that gives us a grand total of just under 5,000 euros. Basically kind of break even from the accidents I had in the previous video. That's in the playlist of Euro Truck Simulator 2 if you want to take a look at it. And uh, experience points, I got 270 XP. Not enough to even get up to level 5. Still got probably another, what, maybe 2, maybe 3 more deliveries before I get to level 5. But you know what? We're getting experience as we go along and discovering new roads, discovering new cities, and hopefully discovering better driving skills. Thank you so much for watching. My name is Kyle. It's been Kyle Plays Games. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did like the video, hit that like button and be sure to, to uh, share the video with your friends to let them get a good laugh at my um, antics and my unfortunate webcam. My, why is it so blurry? Uh, okay, well, we're just going to have to go. Again, go with it. I'm not going to deal with the uh, technical issues. Uh, and also, if you'd like to uh, help contribute and help the channel grow, be sure to hit that subscribe button, and that is the biggest thing you can possibly do to help me out when growing this channel. Also, comment. Let me know what you thought about the video, uh, too, down in the comment section. And if you'd like to watch any of these videos happen live, link in the description down below for my Twitch channel, and be sure to follow along on Twitch so you do not miss out when I go live, and you can see all the screw-ups that happen before I start the recording for YouTube and afterwards. Uh, sometimes it's pretty uh, pretty good stuff. I don't know. Maybe it is. Maybe it isn't. Or maybe just me just like waiting for the game to load, and then I get this going. Anyway, you wouldn't know unless you if you follow on Twitch, but be sure to subscribe here on YouTube and follow on Twitch. Help support the channel in two different ways. And also, if you'd like to help contribute to the channel uh, in uh, another way, there are a few of the links in the description down below as well. And if you do contribute in those by those links, I will in turn add your username to future videos at the end screen to show that you did support the channel out and it is recognized. Okay, got that all out. All right, thank you so much for watching. My name is Kyle. It's been Kyle Plays Games. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe, and I hope to see you in the next video.